what's good y'all it's your boy ross back again with another video so i woke up this morning to some crazy wrestling related news we gotta talk about what's been going on in the wrestling world especially in wwe right now they have uh pretty much shook some things up so the first thing we're going to talk about today is the netflix to stream wwe raw in a five billion dollar deal that is insanity seems like monday night raw will be moving to netflix next year we got to see what's going on with that man i, I definitely wanted to get this news stories out to you today you guys been hitting me up on twitter so we're gonna talk about that first the weekly wrestling program will move to netflix in 2025 as a part of a 10-year agreement that represents a big leap into live events for the streaming platform a 10-year agreement is starting next year that's wild just in itself that's wild <clears throat> Netflix reached a multi-billion dollar 10-year deal for the exclusive rights for WWE's flagship weekly wrestling show, Raw, as the streaming giant broadens its offerings with more live content. The deal will bring Raw to Netflix starting in January 2025. Netflix and the TKO Group, WWE's parent company, said in a statement, Netflix will also own the rights to stream WWE's other shows and specials outside of the united states the agreement will cost netflix more than five billion dollars and will last for 10 years with an option to extend an additional 10 years or to opt out after five a tko group said in a regular uh, regulatory filing by combining our reach recommendations and fandom with wwe we'll be able to deliver more joy and value for their audience and our members netflix chief content officer um bella Baja, uh, bajari bajaria i'm pretty sure i butchered that said in the statement raw will <clears throat> raw which stated uh, started uh, the careers of like Stone Cold Steve Austin, John Cena, Dwayne, The Rock Johnson, we got to talk about him later on, has appeared on uh, on linear television since its debut in 1993. It now airs on the USA Network where it draws 17.5 million unique viewers um, a year according to WWE. TKO, uh, which is controlled by the Hollywood power uh, broker Ari Emanuel uh, Endeavor, was created by the merger of WWE and Ultimate Fighting Championship last year, said in a separate statement that Mr. Johnson would join its board. TKO shares uh, jumped about 17% on Tuesday. Netflix shares were up slightly. With the WWE deal, Netflix, which has 247 million subscribers, greatly expands its stable of live programming, which also includes the reality show Love is Blind. The company has recently, I don't know if y'all heard that, uh, Thunder, it's, it's raining bad out here in Houston. The company has recently focused on sports documentaries over live sports, but adding Raw to its lineup brings it, 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 brings it in closer competition with rivals like Peacock, which has made its uh, live sporting events a backbone of its service and recently streamed a national football uh, league playoff game the announcement came a day after netflix and scott uh, stuber the company's film chairman who lured film filmmakers like ryan johnson zack snyder and greta uh, gerwig to streaming service would de uh, depart in march netflix will report its quarterly earnings on tuesday afternoon this is crazy so monday night raw the show that's been on standard television for the longest time is moving to Netflix exclusively. <clears throat> that's major in a $5 billion deal for 10 years. And they can opt out at five. That's insanity. That's going to be crazy. I already have Netflix. I've had Netflix for a long time. For those who, there's a lot that probably don't know. Back when I was a kid, when Netflix first started, my mom stopped going to Blockbuster and started doing Netflix. And for those who don't know, you know, kids out there, Netflix was just, you could rent DVDs. They would mail you like three DVDs at a time. 
And you can keep those DVDs as long as you want, as long as you was paying the monthly payments. And then you can return them back whenever you were done, which kind of killed Blockbuster at the time. Because you didn't have to worry about late fees. You can just keep them as long as you want. Just keep paying the monthly payments. Then they turned into what it is now. And the fact that now Netflix is going to be hosting Monday Night Raw exclusively. This is going to be very interesting. Tuning in to Netflix to watch Monday Night Raw. I mean, it, it puts a little bit more emphasis on me using Netflix more. So that's a cool thing. The question is how stable it's going to be because if it's this is exclusively streaming. So how stable is Monday Night Raw going to be since they're going to be doing a live platform um, situation now like Peacock and I think they're going to start trying to get into them deals like Amazon Prime they have the exclusive deals to be uh, to show uh, Thursday Night Football I think they're going to try to get into that bag of streaming live events and I think they wanted to start with WWE and if that is the case because I, I do think Peacock is still going to be streaming the PLEs but if that is the case we never know Maybe there's a situation at some point. Maybe they start streaming PLEs on Netflix if they feel like things are going great. And Netflix start trying to get other live sporting events on their on their uh, platform exclusively so people can go there. That's really what it is. It's a big game in these, these companies on trying to get these exclusive rights to stream certain stuff so people will be forced to watch if they want to watch this they gotta go here they gotta pay to go here so gonna be very interesting to see how this plays out but monday night raw is moving to netflix next year at the beginning of 2025 crazy times we live in but comment down below let me know do you guys agree with this move do you guys disagree with this move let me know how you guys feel about monday night raw moving to netflix next year but i appreciate all the love and support you guys shown on channel bro 250k and i'm still on speed the youtube wrestling champ of the world appreciate y'all kicking to me see y'all next one peace